more than a half nope. mile high. <laughs> Did it open? Missed it. <laughs> now we gotta wait. Kidding. So they told him when he stands out there on that little skateboard. Uh, 12,000 feet. Keep thumping her. Keep, she's coming up. Keep her going. On that little skateboard like platform. They practice this a lot and they call a technique a bunny hop. Okay, I'm leaving. Supposed to jump off there, just kind of dropping. Because at first, as I say, he'll have no control because there's so little resistance. They do expect he may roll a little bit. He did last time. Seven or eight times, actually. A gentle roll over. And that's not risky, not dangerous. What one hopes against is a, okay, about 112, spin, feet now, Billy. a fast spin. And 127, man. Or tumble. He has a, an emergency chute that if he were to tumble too fast, too many G-forces, automatic, would automatically deploy. So that's another thing to watch for as long as you don't see that emergency chute come out in the first minutes of this jump. That's a very good sign. So the good signs would be no wild-looking tumble or spin and no drogue chute suddenly coming out. So then, because that air is so thin, that's the point at which they expect that he will break through the sound barrier. Maybe 30 seconds after he drops off, he will gradually, at the, at, at the end and, and the beginning, he has no control at all, but toward, toward the 30 second mark, he begins to get a little control, and he'll try to put his head down. Slide the seat forward. Okay, item 29, release seat belt. Item 29, Felix, release the seat belt. Attaboy, that's good. Okay, slide forward into the rest position. further forward so we can check your shoot. Your shoot's okay, Felix. I say it again. Item 31, your shoot integrity is checked. Your parachutes are not deployed. Item 32, verify cutaway knife handle strap is attached. The knife in proper position. Say Roger if it's so. Roger. Okay. Chest pack face plate heat is on. Make certain that's is on and you got a red light. Just red light is on. Okay, uh, here we go. Item 34. Disconnect chest pack umbilical. Okay, uh, do you read me, Felix, on the communications? Give me a short count. Okay. Stow umbilical. Disconnect both oxygen supply hoses. Okay, are they disconnected? 
Give me a thumbs up if they're disconnected. I know they're still connected. Felix, disconnect the oxygen hose. Atta boy. All right, stand up on the exterior step. Keep your head down. Release the helmet tie down strap. Start the cameras. And our guardian angel will take care of you. Speed 600 miles per hour. Speed 650 miles per hour. Speed 700. Speed 725. Speed 729. Well, that's very, very reassuring what we've seen there. A high speed drop, and now you can see from the little dot, there's the applause. You said something. Can't Family applauding, but you can see by can the little dot that he's in controlled descent. Two minutes into free fall. So two minutes. Felix, keep talking. Still can't quite make that out, but reassuring to hear his voice. And you can see how he's in control there. That's showing you the supply of oxygen in his oxygen bottles. Yes, Felix, I hear you. Go ahead. Roger, go ahead. Go ahead, Felix. I hear you. Go ahead. Oh, my friend. Oh, I have been following the for a long time. I have like a half hour. Still three times. You're really stable when you fall in three and a half minutes. Record is. I have to fall before because my riser is fucking up. I repeat, my riser is fucking up. 
So you can understand that. He said his visor was fogging up, but he's getting to warmer altitudes. There's the shoot. There's the shoot. parachute now could have done any better myself there's there's from the helicopter the north now at five to ten out of the north under canopy and you can contact floating Mike Todd safely on this frequency Give Mike floating Todd safely call down order. to earth There's Ava Baumgartner. Felix, the winds out of the north, 5 to 10. Give my a call. Tears of joy over. from Mission Control. As Felix now Felix, approaches right, the ground. Uh, I hear you. The winds here are out of the east at about 10 to 15. So, so we're, we're now at 6,000 feet. This is Mission Control Felix's current altitude under the chute is 6,600 feet. Okay. On direction. So he has the highest We're jump. For you, but we can't find you. Uh, the temperature what? didn't work. There he is. There's a closer, sh closer shot from the helicopter. Felix, the wind's out of the north, 5 to 10. Beautiful shot. Facing that big car. I don't know how to get here. I'm facing that big car. Okay, and the wind's out of the east. I'm sorry, I gave you the wrong information. Out of the east. Oh, you're feeling like we're coming your way, bud. Carry on, buddy. Clear. Hurry up. Coaching her. Felix, wind is out of the east. The wind is out of the east. Under parachute, you have we see it. We're quite, coming your way right now. quite a bit of control by pulling this. Land down and cover your direction. Wind's out of the east, Felix. Wind's out of the by east. By pulling the cords, he can control a fair amount of control on his path into this landing. Now we see that scrub earth below. Felix's altitude is 5,800 feet. Just 5,000 feet now, so really nearing. And the altitude out there, I'm not sure of the altitude on the ground. Hey, drop from clear, guys. Drop from target clear. Luke's making the call to drop smoke, Felix. That means to Luke's drop a east, Felix. smoke marker from one of the helicopters. Oh, he wanted to see, I see. He wanted the smoke so he could see the wind direction. Hey, Felix, the wind is coming from the ridge. The wind is coming from the ridge. No, towards the ridge. Art Sorry. Thompson, the, wind the is technical director the ridge. of the Red Bull Status Program, telling him that the wind is coming from the direction of that ridge I was talking about. So he certainly got the highest jump mark that he was after. 
We'll find out about the mock. Did he break the speed of sound as he hoped? Here he's coming. And there you can see by the approaching shadow, he's just about there, and he's down on the earth, safely in the Down on his knees, what a shot. So he has the new record. Control shows recovery crew is at uh, Felix's location. Also, Mitch Control shows uh, the motor has been cut from the capsule and the capsule is on its descent. So in there fast, he has the world's record now for the highest jump by far. Around 28,000 feet. So more than 24 miles up, successful after all this training, all this work, all this time, there is the capsule being lowered. It has been cut away from the balloon, its parachute deploying automatically, and the capsule comes down to preserve the data and the pictures that are there. There's Stratos capsule altitude is uh, family celebrating. 4,000 feet. Mrs. Baumgartner, friends, Felix Baumgartner Sr.'s father, all celebrating here at Mission Control. There's the recovery helicopter very near where he landed, out to the east of Roswell. Yeah, we have unofficial word there on some of those those statistics. It was a four minute, and uh, this was unofficial as they got it in mission control. Four minute and 22 second drop in free fall. So that would not break the Kittinger record for that. Would not break the record for the elapsed time of the free fall. And we'll see, did he break Mach? Those were speeds up in the 700 mile an hour mark. So I think that's unofficial and calculated a bit differently than the instrumentation aboard his pressure suit. But that looks like he probably broke Mark. Mach, excuse me. But we'll see, that has to wait. And he broke the record, as we mentioned, for the highest manned balloon flight. So after some tense moments, the issue in flight with the visor, which was successfully resolved, there you have it. Aerospace history has been made today. Austrian pilot and parachutist Felix Baumgartner has done it. Made Red Bull Stratus mission to the edge of space a part of the record books. A successful climax to years of careful planning and development. Along the way, there were setbacks, snags in development of the equipment, weather delays, but today, Baumgartner and the Red Bull Stratos team are celebrating. Celebrating on the ground there at the scene now. More celebrations will follow here at Mission Control. So we're still awaiting final confirmation, but unofficially, new world records have been set for the highest free fall ever, the fastest free fall ever, as well as the highest ever manned balloon flight. And today was also a big win for science, as the Red Bull Stratos team collected valuable data that could ultimately help improve the safety of space travel and enable high-altitude emergency bailouts from spacecraft. The coverage doesn't end here. For more updates, including reaction from Baumgartner and the team, we encourage you to visit redbullstratos.com. So for now, this is Robert Hager, Saying so long from Roswell, New Mexico.